All right, welcome back. So whether you decide to walk, run, or roll, there are a variety of ways to support cancer survivors at Cancer Champions annual event. And joining us this morning is the founder of Cancer Champions, Jen Miramontes, and we have Kirk Keeler, a stage four cancer survivor, as well as an athlete who's gonna be participating this weekend. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Jen, we're gonna start with you. Tell, tell us a little bit about just the origins of Cancer Champions, how it came about. Sure, so over 20 years ago, my mom was diagnosed with terminal cancer and uh, she was struggling and decided that she was done with treatment. And a question I asked her was, do you have a bucket list item? And it was to climb in and out of the Grand Canyon. Wow, yes. okay. Yeah, thank you, exactly my thought, <laughs> what she told me. Um, but she did it, and in the process of her, us getting her ready for it, we you know, started to notice that by adding fitness and nutrition and kind of working with her on the kind of positivity behind it, that everything changed. Her quality of life with stage four terminal cancer was getting better. And ultimately, she ended up living two years past her diagnosis. Wow, that so, is amazing. And, yeah. and I, Kirk, maybe nobody else understands exactly how much mm -hmm. staying healthy, staying active can mean during after getting uh, that diagnosis. Absolutely, yeah. I think, uh, you know, really where my, um, journey begins with her is uh, I yeah, just went through a bunch of chemo and uh, was on a little down phase and I just had this idea like, man, I'd really like to do something big and, and uh, climb half dome came in my brain. Okay. And uh, yeah, and so I, I, uh, I talked with my palliative care uh, person at UC Davis Health about it and she hooked me up with, with this wonderful woman and I told her this, she was the first person to hear this idea and she's like, you know, you just put that out there, we're gonna make this happen. So um, she's been helping me ever since. All right, so available this weekend to sign up is a 5K, a 10K or a mile. You got it. And you can participate in, in a variety of ways. So how do folks sign up? Uh, super simple, cancerchampions.org. And, um, and I think it's important to mention that while these are huge achievements, like yeah. Kirk, which by the way, he forgot to mention that he did climb half, free climb half down. Oh, congratulations. So there's yeah. that. Amazing. Yeah. Um, and the feet of my mom doing the Grand Canyon are amazing, but walking a mile with cancer is, can, can be a huge feat. Absolutely. Um, and that's a lot of why we have this available to people, so that they have this opportunity uh, to get out there and move and, and recognize the importance of this movement. So Absolutely. Saturday morning. All right. And of course, we'd be remiss if we didn't mention, you can also do this virtually. So you can either yes. do it in person or you can sign up online. Yes, yes. So people that are out of town, um, and actually the, the great thing is, is this map is more full now than uh, showing. So we have people from ov all over the world yeah. and throughout the country that are going to be doing it virtually. So they'll, they'll have their t-shirt and their bib, but they'll be doing it from wherever they are. Very nice, very inspirational. Jen and Kirk, thank you so much for being here this morning. Mm, thank you. And sharing your stories.